دعوت دینا چاہوں گا انگلش کتاب کے لیے میرے برادر برسٹر محمد اشتاق احمد صاحب کو دعائیں اور بچوں کے خاص طور پہ انگلش میں پیغام ہو دیں We are truly blessed once again to attend Milad House, the annual Methil in Milad, under the blessing supervision of one of the flowers from the garden of Rasulullah sallallahu alayhi wa sallam. SubhanAllah. And it is great pleasure for me to associate myself with Daid Darit Nur Not just Daid Darit Nur He is the Dajdar of all the Nakshbandi Hamdaz in Pakistan. Okay, SubhanAllah. It is an undeniable fact. We are blessed with the presence of Tahir Dari Tura Shri Sayyid Muhammad Kabir Ali Shah Naqshbandi Gilani Ujjadadi and it goes without saying and if any of us was to turn around and say that we are not aware of the other personality which is in this room Alama Nisad Beg Saab then that would also be something that we would not be able to justify this this Alami Deen is no secret Allah. to the fact Allah. that when Ahlis Sunnat Mul Jamal emanated in the United Kingdom, one of the forces behind that Jamal was Allah Masa. May Allah SWT grant Allah Masa a long and healthy life, and may He continue to deliver the service that He delivers to the beautiful face of Islam. There's a beautiful verse of the Holy Quran which I had the privilege of reciting. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala says it is undeniable of Muhammad. But you, my beloved, are a mercy to the whole of creation. Not just this world and that world. Because beyond these worlds, there was a world before as well. So Rasulullah sallallahu alayhi wa sallam is a mercy to the whole of creation. Subhanallah. And for us then to hold metals like this is only a small sign of gratitude. When somebody gives you something on the street, be it a sweet, be it a token of friendship, be it an increase in salary when you're at work. What do you do when you turn around? When somebody gives you that, you turn around to, to the person that gives it to you and you say, thank you. What do you say? Thank you. You are grateful for it. Well, if you're grateful for something that's so small in this life, why can't you be grateful for the one by whose wasila Allah has given you Good health, Allah has given you parents, Allah has given you children, siblings, work, health, a good lifestyle, the ability to see you name all the name that Allah subhanahu has given you. And I can assure you that there are several verses in the Holy Quran, and Mullah and Sabah are present and they can verify this. There are several, there are uncountable verses in the Holy Quran where Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala makes it clear. Had it not been for my Muhammad, I would not have created any one of you. Now, 
when I first came in this afternoon, Kibla Pizza said to me that um, I want you to say a few words in English, and I've said those. But some of the children before were reciting Nazis, and the Nazis and Kibla Kalisab as well refer to a Nazi where it refers to Nabi Pak Sallallahu being only one of his kind. There is no other like him. And I was reading just a couple of days ago some verses that were written, written by Alama Al Haj Abdul Sattar Niazi. And they read, they wrote a beautiful Nazri. And I'm going to recite just two verses. Ya Mustafa Herul Bara. wrote this the evidence that he gathered comes from day one when Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala created his blessed Muhammad from his own nur Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala vouched for the fact that there will be no other Muhammad when the prophets were asked in Masjid Al-Aqsa, when they were reciting Salah behind Rasulullah Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam, and each one of them will have looked at each other. Yusuf will have looked at Musa Al Islam, Musa Al Islam will have looked at Ibrahim Al Islam, who will have looked at his beautiful son Ismail Al Islam. But each one of them then will have looked at Rasulullah Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam and said, We are all beautiful, but none can match this beautiful personality. Only I come in need. A wali does not become a wali. Unless he has love for Rasulullah sallallahu alayhi wa sallam. May Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala give us the tawfiq to follow in the footsteps of those who shed their blood, who shed tears in the midst of the night for the love of Rasulullah sallallahu alayhi wa sallam.